Shut up and sit down. Davis Cup semi-finals, Australia and France lead after winning doubles. Leighton Hewitt's side are one win away from the Davis Cup final. Australia took a 2-1 lead in their Davis Cup semi-final against Belgium with victory in the doubles. John Pierce and Jordan Thompson beat Rubens Bemelmans and Arthur de Grief 6-3, 6-4, 6-0 on clay in Brussels. In the other semi-final, nine-time champions France lead Serbia, who are without Novak Djokovic, 2-1. Pierre Hughes Herbert and Nicolas Mahut beat Filip Krajinovic and Nenad Zimanjic 6-1, 6-2, 7-2, 7-3, in less than two hours on clay in Lille. Herbert and Mahut, two-time Grand Slam doubles winners, lost only two points on serve in the first set and were barely troubled. Serbia began the day level at 1-1 following Friday's singles rubbers, with world number 80 Dusan Lajevic having secured a shock victory over 22nd ranked Lucas Koero. Joe Wilfried Tsonga saw off Davis Cup debutante Laszlo Jair to level for favorites France, who are trying to win a first Davis Cup title since 2001. The score was also level after the opening day in Brussels, after David Goffin beat John Millman and Nick Kyrgios came back from two sets to one down to beat Steve Darcy's. Australia, under captain Leighton Hewitt, are attempting to secure a first Davis Cup triumph since 2003. Two-time Grand Slam champions Nicolas Mahut and Pierre Hughes Herbert beat Filip Krajinovic and Nena Zimanjic 6-1, 6-2, 7-6, 3, for France to lead Serbia 2-1 in the Davis Cup semifinals on Saturday. Apart from a scare in the third set when the Serb pair won four games in a row, Mahat and Herbert were in control on the indoor clay court and put France one win away from its 18th Davis Cup final. It was surprising. Davis Cup doubles you usually see marathon five-setters, Thompson said. In the northern city of Lille, the French were flawless on their service games until 5-2 in the third set when Herbert was broken after he hit a double fault. The Serbian duo broke again following two beautiful winners from Krajinovic a perfect lob and passing shot but the French proved stronger in the tiebreaker. We are super happy and very proud, said Herbert, who won Wimbledon and the US Open with Mahut. It's never easy to serve for the match, I felt weaker at the worst time. Mahut, who has been hampered by a calf injury in recent weeks, thanked the medical staff for enabling him to play. They did not count their hours to put me back on my feet, he said. This victory is also theirs. <laughs>